da 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 Ludi da di da Hey check 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 mess around with the other melodies. Uh, but I like it. Uh, I'm like a fairy man. Um, Hilfer's gonna love that. Say what? He's like a fairy man. He uh, <laughs> said fairy man. <laughs> yeah, was, I'm yeah. smelling an edit piece again in our future. Is that what, is that what that was? <laughs> no Pro Tools, no razor blades, pal. No razor blades. No razor blades. No razor blades. <laughs> No, we're taking it one step further than the no Pro Tools thing. No razor blades. <laughs> if you want to cut, take it with your teeth. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I've done that before. I'm not afraid. Do <laughs> you have an intro? Yeah, I was like...
gonna be amazed if you actually. I already was amazed, but I'm not like it. You guys uh, played some pretty uh, interesting gigs in the '90s uh, on the on the board tour with uh, the Black Crows, and then uh, I think you guys opened some dates uh, for the Man in Black, Johnny Cash. Uh, any, any favorite memories or stories from from working with Johnny Cash? Um, well, when we the first time we met him was in Austin. We were thinking about signing to the, the label he was on at the time, American Recordings. And so the label set it up so we could meet him, and I was going to like ask him if it was a good idea, which is, in retrospect, is pretty silly. And, and of course he's going to say it's a good idea. But I did, I asked him, he was going to serious. I don't even remember what he said, but he... Something very convinced. We signed that. We signed him. Day. Day. <laughs> <laughs> That's all. He told us to do it, so we did it. If Johnny Cash tells you to do something, pretty much you're going to do it. So we did. I read in a recent interview, I guess, Tim, that you said that, uh, that this band has real special, I guess, special chemistry uh, as far as playing together. Yeah. Can you elaborate on that? I think you uh, made some mention of the fact that, you know, you've been playing with Greg since, you know, you're in college. Yeah, I mean, we, just, we shared, we, we sort of, you know, we expose each other to the music that we were listening to in high school when we first met, which was really enlightening. But what we also did was that we sort of taught each other what we had, what we knew up to that point. Greg was a guitar player and I was only a singer. So we both had something that the other guy didn't and we were both wanted to be both of those things. So we basically learned how to play and sing together. And it just, we're just so intertwined. Even if we didn't want to be, we would be still. It's just, we just, there's, there's only, it only, you only get that once. You only have one time in your life when you don't know how to play guitar.